There is one organ which causes high blood pressure, and it's not what you think. And there are specific exercises you can use to target and fix your blood pressure easily. No diet, lifestyle changes, or medication required. Check the link in the description below, but for now, today's question. Two, one. Now I will popularize some knowledge about hypertension to all of you. Carrot one. We should know that the common sense about kidney, an essential organ of our body. So I find this photo from this picture one. We can understand the structure of kidney. Two. Now let us amplify the nephron. You can find it on the picture one as the basic structural and functional unit of the kidney, which filters the blood in order to regulate chemical concentrations and thereby produces urine. Okay. This is what it looked like. The two arterial show on the top is the key to this question. Three. I talk about blood vessel and hypertension. Do you know what is blood pressure and how hypertension make an effect on vessels? Show you another picture. I draw it underscore carrot. Three hypertension make vessels narrow and blood flow weaken. Therefore, nephrons shrink without function. Four. Kidney has a great number of vessels, just as picture four because impaired vessels, as a result of hypertension. Weaken blood flow the two arteria become narrower, nephrons fail, which means renal failure. This process is an outcome of long term. Renal hypertension can cause chronic kidney disease. This is a slow decline in kidney function until the condition is well advanced. Chronic kidney disease also causes no symptoms. Video, blood pressure exercises VSLCB. Stenting. During angioplasty. A wire mesh stent can be expanded inside the renal artery. The stent stays in place. This keeps the artery open after the balloon is removed. In general, stenting is more effective than angioplasty at improving blood flow to the kidney. Surgery. A surgeon can bypass the narrowed renal artery by sewing a healthy ice blood vessel next to it. Surgery is generally considered only when angioplasty and stenting are not possible. The answer from Ruli Chang is correct. But if you'd like a simpler answer, I thought I'd chip in too. Your kidneys are responsible for filtering the blood to produce urine, getting rid of waste product in your body. When your blood pressure is too high, the kidney needs to filter more blood, more quickly than usual. This puts more stress on the kidneys and can sometimes lead to kidney failure. If you need help controlling your blood pressure, you might like to try this challenge. Madsen How. Com slash blood pressure reset challenge. All the best. High blood pressure, hypertension, IL leading UF kidney disease and D kidney failure, and stage renal disease, hypertension and U damage TTH blood vessels and D filters and TH kidney, making removal F waste from THBD difficult. On a person I diagnosed with end stage renal disease, dialysis, a blood cleansing process, our kidney transplantation are necessary. THTBU at end damage BTHTH large arteries leading to your kidneys and DT kidneys and DT kidneys and glomeruli within TH kidneys. Damage T ether makes it her kidneys and effectively filter waste from her blood. A result, dangerous levels F fluid and D waste and accumulate. You might ultimately require dialysis or kidney transplantation. High blood pressure has become a very common problem, owing to many factors that may include obesity stress, unhealthy diet, aging and more. A proven way to control high blood pressure is given it control your blood pressure. A lot of people got benefited from this technique. High blood pressure can damage blood vessels in the kidneys, reducing their ability to work properly. When the force of blood flow is high, blood vessels stretch so blood flows more easily. Eventually, this stretching scars and weakens blood vessels throughout the body including those in the kidneys. If the kidneys' blood vessels are damaged, they may stop removing waste and extra fluid from the body. Extra fluid in the blood vessels may then raise blood pressure even more, creating a dangerous cycle. High blood pressure is the second leading cause of kidney failure in the United States. After diabetes, as illustrated in figure. In addition, the rate of kidney failure due to high blood pressure increased 7.7% 7 .7 from 2000 to 2010. Kidney problem caused by hypertension is called hypertensive nephropathy which is also commonly called hypertensive kidney disease. You can find more information about its symptoms and treatment here. Slash slash kidney therapy sheena org slash hypertensive nephropathy slash